Good morning, everybody. We're going mountain climbing. So we've just started. It's already beautiful. Got a climb of about 3,200 feet, I think, ahead of me. Uh, between two and three hours, I'm guessing. I'm gonna take my time. I'm gonna thrash myself. And uh, let's just enjoy the journey. Look at that beautiful. That over there. Steady stream of people ahead. Uh, it's been raining non stop for the last two days, so it's not really any surprise that people are heading out today. Forecast is good, so yep, everybody's out. Okay, here is Lingmo Gale. First potential crossing place. Some people are going a little bit further up. I think I might do that just to uh, jump the queue. Ways to go yet. But this is a good first uh, landmark down here. Okay, landscapers uh, change now. More shingle, more scree. Just a minute halfway. So there's basically two roads you can go. You can go this way, which is the way I'm going to go because I haven't done this before. If you feel adventurous, you can head up through What's the steeper climb, lots of scree, get you there quicker. I'm in no hurry, so that way it is. I can only really look around when I've stopped moving because you're having to pick every single footstep at this point. It's fun though. There she is, boys and girls. Long time coming.
So behind me is the summit, did it? About two and a half hours. It's glorious up there, not too cold, not too windy and clear, which is what I really, really wanted. So I can't complain. Uh, the route down is going to be hell on the knees, but hey, there's no really easy way to do it, is there? Anyway, better get cracking. I reckon I can do it in about two hours. Again, not hurrying. Halfway down, a bit more actually. Coming down every bit as hard. There's literally no respite on this climb or descent. On Snowdon you get kind of little areas where there's it plateaus just for a while, all the gradients manageable. Not here. You're either up or you're down and there isn't anything in between. So that makes for a, quite a challenge, certainly uh, for this old dude. But I've loved it. I'm just taking the time to get back down now. Joy's going to meet me in the car park. It's been glorious and it was just so lovely to get a clear summit. But boy, my knees are uh, acting up. I've uh, fallen twice, which I think is probably about the going rate um, here, to be honest with you. It's normally on like the rough sort of scree on the higher kind of echelons so uh, big word echelons anyway uh, so yeah so I'd expect I'm probably within the last hour now so uh, slow and steady wins the race I say that as if there's an alternative option there really isn't we'll get there <laughs> 